Mars used to look a lot like Earth. The planet had a vast sea under oxygen-rich skies, and as far as we know, all the right conditions for life. But while Earth was beginning to see its first glimpse of life, Mars was losing its chance of becoming a habitable world. We don't know why, but roughly 4.2 billion years ago, Mars's magnetic field disappeared. That magnetic field protected the young planet from a constant barrage of solar winds ejected from the sun. But once it was gone, Mars's warm, rich atmosphere was blown out of the solar system. And all that's left now is the rocky, cold, and uninhabitable planet we know today. But could we make Mars habitable again? NASA might have a new strategy to do just that. They theorize that placing a large magnetic dipole shield between Mars and the Sun, they can protect the planet from the Sun's solar winds and perhaps establish a new atmospheric equilibrium. Mars would live in the dipole's magnetotail, essentially restoring its lost magnetosphere, giving the planet a chance to re-establish its long-lost atmosphere. NASA's simulations show that as the atmosphere thickens, Mars's climate would become four degrees Celsius warmer, enough to melt the carbon dioxide ice at the polar cap. The carbon in the atmosphere would then trap heat, creating a greenhouse effect that could give Mars back its liquid water and allow for a better chance of becoming a habitable planet. This is, of course, theoretical and seems rather fanciful, but there is already research underway into miniature magnetospheres that may one day protect humans and spacecrafts on deep space missions. So it's not inconceivable to apply that technology on a larger scale. And NASA has stated that if this can be achieved in a lifetime, the colonization of Mars would not be far away. Scientists are trying to predict the future of our own protective magnetic shield. Click here to find out what's in store for us here on Earth.